Hello, I'm Father Joe Gambala, pastor of St. Malachi Catholic Church in Sterling Heights. Welcome to Saints of the Summer. Today is August the 25th. Back in the 1970s, I went to college at the University of Michigan, and I was in the classics department. I had a minor in classics, which involved taking a lot of Latin classes. And one of the things you could get an extra credit for would be to participate in the Latin play. The classics department would put on a Latin play every year, usually something from either Plautus or Terence, two very famous uh, Latin comedian playwrights of the early centuries of Rome. Well, today's saint, Saint Genesius, was an actor, a comedic actor in these plays. He would perform roles in either a play by Plautus or by Terence. Uh, they were very well attended. He knew how to, you know, do a phrase just the right way to get a good laugh. And as Christianity is uh, growing stronger and stronger, one of the ways these actors would get laughs, because, you know, most of the audience is pagan. And for most of these pagans, you know, some would, you know, convert, but others would hear bad things about the Christians. And so one of the ways to get a cheap laugh was to make fun of the Christians. And Genesius would do that. He would, he would uh, add lines or do, uh, twist a phrase so that he could make fun of the Christians out there. And people would get a good laugh. But the thing is, during uh, this, this time period while he's acting, he's actually meeting a few other Christians. And he's realizing there really isn't anything to laugh at, that these people are being seriously persecuted. And he wanted to know why. So he began to learn about the faith. And in the course of learning about the faith, he decided that he would become a Christian himself. And he decided to announce that in the middle of a play, so in the middle of a performance, and by this time, Dionysius is a very famous actor in Rome, he announces in the middle of a play to the entire audience that he was a Christian and that he wasn't acting anymore and that it was for real and that he did believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and that the Lord Jesus Christ was his Savior. And of course, with that, the audience brutally attacked him and killed him.